Hello, this is Craig with Connected Solutions Group. In this video, we will go over how to set up and operate your M212 router. Every M212 router comes with a power adapter, two Wi-Fi antennas, two 4G LTE antennas, an ethernet cable, user manual, warranty card, and a wall mount kit. Attaching the antennas. Look for the two antennas with the Wi-Fi 6 icons on them. The Wi-Fi antennas need to be installed to the middle two antenna ports. The 4G LTE antennas need to be attached to the two outside antenna ports. Hand tighten until snug. Adding the SIM card. You will need to insert the SIM card if one is not already included in your M212. Make sure the router is powered off. You can tell it's off when no lights are on the display. To power off the M212, press and hold the red button on the side until the lights on the display stop glowing. With the router powered off, insert the primary SIM card into the SIM slot on the left. The M212 comes with a second SIM slot. This can be used for a secondary failover connection that will automatically kick in when your primary connection fails. Powering on and charging. Plug the provided charger into an outlet or power strip, then plug the charger into the charge port. Once powered on, give it a few minutes for the router to boot up. You will know it is fully operational when all the lights on the device glow white. The battery icon on the left of the display is where you can see your M212 battery level. If the charge status is not being displayed, you can tap the power button to bring it back up. One square means battery is under 25% charged. Two squares, 25 to 50% charged. Three squares, 50 to 75% charged. And all four squares, over 75% charged. 4G signal strength. You can check your LTE signal strength by looking at the cellular bars on the display. Four bars means the device is receiving excellent signal. Three bars means the M212 is in a good signal area. Two bars means the device may be performing at reduced performance and speeds due to lack of signal. One bar means your signal is on the tower's edge and you will likely have an unstable connection. Connecting to device. You can connect in two ways, Wi-Fi and direct connect via LAN cable. To connect directly by LAN, plug the ethernet cable into the LAN port on the router then the ethernet port on your device, and you are good to go. To connect through Wi-Fi, open your Wi-Fi interface on your device. Look for the signals called CSG-XXXX, which is 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi signal, or CSG-XXXX-5G, which is 5 GHz Wi-Fi signal. The default password is the same as the router key, printed on the label on the back of the router. Once connected, you should see the 2.5 GHz and or 5 GHz icons flashing on the router display. That means the data is passing through and the connection is working. If they are lit but solid, that means data is working, but no information is currently passing through. If the icons are off, that means either Wi-Fi is disabled, the device is in IP pass-through mode, or it is not fully booted. CSG View Every CSG device comes with CSG View, a free, user-friendly cloud management platform that allows you to remotely monitor your network. After your purchase, you are sent login credentials to register your account. Within seven days of receiving your credentials, complete your registration at csgview.com using the provided username and password. Once there, you can rename your routers, customize your network name and Wi-Fi password, create a guest network, set up notifications for any outages, and more, all from one convenient place. If your router connection is slowing or attempts to access internet fails, you can repair your network signal by pressing the reset button and holding for three seconds, then releasing. If that does not work, you can reset your M212 to factory settings by holding the reset button for 10 seconds, then releasing. If neither step resolves connection, contact our 24-7 support team at 800-613-2218. Enjoy your new M212! If you have any questions, please contact us at support at thisiscsg.com or call us at 800-613-2218.